You should pull the fucking trigger. Pull the trigger. Ain't nobody gonna do for you. And what is going on guys, this is Ella Shady here bringing you back a new video. And in this video I'm going to be showing you how to basically start your YouTube channel with almost no money involved. And you're going to need some basic stuff for this and one of them is you're going to have to have a YouTube account obviously. Another one is that you're going to have to um, have either an Xbox One or a PS4. You can also have a PC but um, this video is mostly for console players like I am. So let's get it started folks. Also uh, one thing that is recommended but not um, not necessary is to have a laptop and to have a phone. But that's just uh, recommended on my part. Also you need a mic obviously. Um, <clears throat> so basically let's get it started. So all you need to do in the Xbox One is we all have the Upload Studio app and, and here you can edit your uh, your things and your, like your um, like when you say Xbox Record though like just you know normal things like normal gameplay that you want to record you can always like edit them here and if you didn't know you can record gameplay like if you're playing like let's say uh halo 5 or black ops 3 or something you can just go to the game dvr i mean you can just snap game dvr either by saying xbox uh xbox snap game dvr or if you don't have a connect you have uh you can go to the guide menu and then go all the way down to snap and then you can snap game dvr and then you can record for five minutes but there's also a way that you can record for longer than five minutes and that is once you're uh, once you have it snapped and recording, just unsnap it. And then w when you snap it again, when you want to finish recording, it's gonna say like recorded for three mi uh, th for three seconds or something. But it's actually gonna be recorded for longer than uh, three seconds. And it still works. It's always worked ever since the Xbox came out. And I've tried it a couple days ago, and it's still working. So once you do that, and then you can edit you can edit stuff on Apple Studio. Like you can. You can add an intro, you can add templates, you can add whatever you want. You know, you can do a top five series. You can do anything. Basically, you can add little text and stuff. That's how I. Uh, that's how I uh, did it for a while. And you can also like include your voice in here. Once you, uh, you can add a voiceover. Obviously, it doesn't, it doesn't give me that feature right now because I don't have gameplay. Uh, I don't have gameplay selected. But that's basically what you can do. You know, you can change the effects and everything. And then if you go on the PS4 side, I'm not going to have gameplay on it because I don't have a PS4, obviously. But what you can also do on that um, on the PS4 is that you can you can also record gameplay, I think, for 15 minutes over there. And you can edit it. You can trim it by the share share play button feature that they have. Um, the editing is not as advanced as it is on the Xbox One, but that's still okay because you're still getting started and stuff. Um, so after you, after you finish um, uploading and editing and all that, you can go to the YouTube app. This also works for the PS4. Once you're done, you can go to the YouTube app. And for the Xbox One, this feature's been around for a while. And for the PS4, they when they got the P, uh, the YouTube app, they they can still do this too. So what you can do is you can go to uploads, and then you can go to uploads, and then here it's gonna give you um, it's gonna give you like the videos that you have, and you can upload them to uh, YouTube. And you can even add a title, like let's say if I uploaded this, I can add a title and I can like upload it uh, public or or unlisted or private. So now we're gonna get to part two of this video because this is a uh, this was like the basic thing that you can use, you know, because like that's what I used for a while in the beginning of my videos. I used to just use the upload studio feature and stuff. But once you get more advanced, you're gonna you're gonna need the things that I recommended earlier, which is a a phone and a laptop and basically what you want to do with that is that with the phone there's a or for iPhones I know for iPhones this is how I'm recording this commentary there's a stock app which a stock app means basically that it's always in the phone kinda of like Safari and like the app store and stuff and it's in the folder extras and it's, it's called voice memo and what you can do there is you can uh, plug in like your Xbox mic or your PS4 mic and it's gonna have clear quality like the quality that I'm using right now it's from my Xbox, uh, my Xbox mic and the reason for this is that phones are meant to be, like, you're meant to be on the phone. You know, you're meant to be talking on the phone, so it's obviously going to be clear. Um, because if you do it on the, through, if you record your gameplay through, like, the Xbox or through the PC, it's still going to sound pretty good, but it's, it's not going to be as great as if you're recording, like, let's say, on a blue snowball mic or just on your phone because the phone has good quality. So what you can do is like right now I'm recording this. So once you're finished recording, I don't know if Androids have this uh, app, but I'm pretty sure you can just download it, and it has the same features and stuff. So once you're done up, uh, you're once you're done um, 
talking, you know, uh, doing your commentary, you can just hit the stop button. And I don't know if I'm probably not going to have gameplay of it because I, I don't have my phone uh, Joe broken anymore, so I can't record my phone. But I will have some pictures, obviously. Uh, you can email it. You can email the voice recording to your uh, to yourself, basically. And then you can go on the PC, and then you can recover the email. And then when you recover that email, you can just um, download it. And then you can always crack a uh, software, you know, like... I mean, you can use uh, Windows Movie Maker, but what I use is I crack the... <laughs> I know, I'm, I'm sorry guys, but you know, do what you have to do. I crack Adobe Premiere Pro, and that's what I've been using for a while now. So I just edit them and sync them together. It's not that hard, actually. It's pretty easy. So you want to do that. You want to just edit them, and, um, and then you can also go on GIMP and then make a custom thumbnail for it. And then that's basically it, guys. That's how I do my YouTube videos. I just use my Xbox. I just use my... PC and I just use my phone. But now uh, I have an HD PVR2, which is actually I got it to work. You know, that's another video for uh, later. But so I don't need to do all that stuff anymore. I just need to record and then edit on my computer. But that was basically it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you if you're having any troubles, just uh, put it down in the comments. Make sure to like and uh, make sure to like and subscribe to my uh, to my channel. I upload, um, you know. Hot topics. I like. I share my thoughts. I do news. You know. I just. I play with friends. I might do tutorials like this too. So this was uh, Ella Shady, and I'm out. Peace.